We begin tonight with breaking news. We have an update on a story Valley News Live exclusively broke to you in November, initially surrounding the Jamestown Police Department. We just learned from Attorney General Wayne Stengem that the BCI criminal investigation is complete and no one will be charged in the case. The BCI identified two possible suspects, Jamestown Police Detective Tom Nagel or Stutzman County Sheriff's Office Sergeant Elizabeth Cap. Based on multiple factors, the investigation found there is not enough evidence to prosecute either one. The original whistleblower complaint went something like this. Someone named Dominic said the Stutzman County Sheriff's Office was using government property for recreational use. Their proof? A picture of a jet ski supposedly owned by, a, by the county and being ridden by the deputy and the sheriff's son. After requesting a list of property owned by the sheriff's department, we discovered that, in fact, never bought a jet ski under their name. The BCI investigation included multiple interviews and an examination of Nagel and Cap's computer. Because the BCI couldn't conclude who sent the packet to Valley News Live and the report could not find any witnesses, no one was charged. However, the internal affairs at the Jamestown Police Department is now investigating the false claims of misuse of government property sent to Valley News Live. We posted the full investigative report from the BCI on our website. Just go to valleynewslive.com. And if you need help uncovering fraud and corruption in your community, call our whistleblower hotline at 701-237-6576 and leave your tip. A member of our investigative team will get to work on the case and work to expose the truth. And then